What's Wiggle and Wear Noticers? It's your boy, Mr. CEO, Big Daddy Shea Muma of this beautiful, awesome, fantastic technology YouTube channel that is Wear Noticing. Guys, this is my review of the Essential Phone. Wear Notice on the baddest beat. Met a lot of people, but still don't know defeat. Running for the White House, but I am no athlete. Got Jordans on my feet and haters in retreat. Wait, I am the CEO. Competition robotic, call him C3PO. So folks, this is the essential phone. And like fine wine, cheese, or meat, it's grown better with age, which is something that I'd never thought I'd say about a smartphone. This device originally came out about a year ago from Essential, a startup company by Android founder Andy Rubin, and has since been amazingly discounted. The device, originally priced at about $700, was just $250 on Amazon Prime Day, and has since had fluctuating prices in the 300s on Amazon, as well as a $499 price tag on Essential's website that includes over $100 worth of accessories. And, needless to say, you get quite a bit for these much lower than before prices. First of all, you get that 5.71 inch 2560 by 1312 pixel quad HD touchscreen display which looks great for media consumption and features that iconic small essential phone notch with an 8 megapixel selfie camera and sadly still a little chin bezel. Its glass is Gorilla Glass 5 while the sides of the phone are titanium and the back is ceramic. The back of the phone houses a flash, dual rear 13 megapixel camera lenses, one color and the other monochrome, a fingerprint sensor, and two pins for attaching essentials, now $50 360 degree camera. On the right side of the phone we've got volume buttons and a power button, and then on the bottom side we've got a speaker grill, USB-C port, and the SIM card tray. But one thing that you won't notice anywhere on the phone is logos or writing of any kind, which helps it fit in with Essentials game plan of giving you what you need, or in other words just the Essentials, and thus keeping the hardware very minimalistic and simple. For instance, it unfortunately doesn't have wireless charging support or full on water resistance, but for the price folks, you really can't complain, can ya? This philosophy also carries over to the phone's software, as the Android running on the Essential phone is supposed to be very very close to stock Android, as well as regularly updated, which although it may be something that iPhone users take for granted to get regular updates and whatnot, it is a true blessing on an Android phone. All this once again ties in with the company's roots from Andy Rubin, and I will say that I very much enjoyed the latest version of Android, Android 9 Pie, on the Essential Phone. Even the unboxing experience with the Essential Phone feels super duper premium and high quality, as it comes in an unnecessarily big box that houses a whopping 27 watt AC adapter, as well as a thick, braided USB-C cable for fast charging the phone's 30-40 mAh battery. That cable, which even has a built-in strap for keeping it organized, and that AC adapter are so much better than what Apple includes with their $1,000 iPhones, so much so that it's pretty mind-boggling that they come included with this much less expensive essential phone. This also does help make up for the lack of wireless charging. But folks, the crazy goodness doesn't stop there. The essential phone comes standard unlocked and with 128GB of built-in storage. Plus, it also comes in a few different colors, including this one that you've been looking at throughout this whole video, which is the Black Moon one with that shiny black back. Now, all in all though, my verdict on the essential phone is it's essentially, see what I did there, just downright awesome for the price. If you can get it for $250, it's really, folks, it's a no-brainer. I personally got it for about $350 before tax, and even then, it's still a wild deal. With that nearly bezel-less screen, those premium titanium and ceramic materials that the phone's made of, and Essential's commitment to giving you up-to-date and bloatware-free Android, and now also with that price to match all of those great things, like I said earlier, folks, it's 2018 now, and the Essential phone has just gotten better with time. And with that, that'll be all for this Wear Notice review, so if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely be sure to smash that subscribe button and subscribe to the Wear Notice Technology YouTube channel for more awesome technology videos just like this one. And with that, folks, thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much for subscribing. Wear Notice, out with a lot of phones, baby.